That's the Stevie Wonder version. Happy birthday. And today a nation singing along with him to say happy birthday to a king. Today is the late Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s birthday. The civil rights activist was born on this day in 1929 right here in Atlanta. He was assassinated April 4th in 1968 in Memphis, Tennessee. At that time, Dr. King was 39 years old. Hmm. He was posthumously awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom and the Congressional Gold Medal. That was in 1986. President Ronald Reagan signed the bill into law, making King's birthday a federal holiday. And this year, it will be celebrated next Monday, January 21st. And right now, festivities leading up to Dr. King's birthday are kicking off at the King Center. Daniel Wilkerson is there live for us this morning. Daniel, I, I think a lot of people may be questioning whether this federal government shutdown is going to impact that. It's not, is it? You know, it's not. The uh, King Center here is a nonprofit, so it is open for today's uh, festivities. You can see the eternal flame famous to so many. They're burning behind me. But let's go ahead and show you uh, the events that will take place today. The formal kickoff reception and Dream Forward Awards program will be he held here at the King Center today. You are welcome here as the event is free and open to the public. The Dream Forward Awards honors uh, organizations and people who are making a difference in a way similar to the way Dr. King did. Uh, so uh, that's uh, also here today. Also here will be the students with King Celebrate Difference gathering. Dr. King's daughter, Dr. Bernice King, will lead the discussion with middle school students on uh, students of various ethnicities. Uh, she'll be educating those young people on the impact of her father's legacy globally. So here's what you should know. The reception at the King Center that I mentioned, it begins today at 6 p.m. with the awards program at 645. Also, we should note the bookstore and resource center are both open. However, Dr. King's childhood home is closed due to the shutdown. So I know we gave you a lot of information there. Of course, you can see the details of that on your free CBS 46 mobile app. We're live this morning in the King District. Daniel Wilkerson, CBS 46 News.